What's up, guys? LQ here. All right, here we go. I'm going to rank the Conjuring movies from worst to best. We're going to do this pretty quickly, all right? I'm not going to do a big review of each of each movie. We're just going to kind of go through it pretty quick. Um, so here we go. The worst of the Conjuring movies. Let's see, how many are there? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There's nine Conjuring movies, so the worst in ninth place is Annabelle. Annabelle is the only Conjuring movie that I actually did not like at all. I found it boring. I found it tedious. It was hard to get through. Um, there was not much of value at all in Annabelle. So that's number nine. Number eight, uh, the one that's very loosely tied to the Conjuring mythology is The Curse of La Llorona. A uh, very generic horror movie, very generic ghost story. Uh, it was definitely more entertaining than Annabelle, but other than that, it didn't really have much to offer the Conjuring universe. Number seven is The First Nun. Uh, very atmospheric, very claustrophobic, um, but also somewhat forgettable. It was um, kind of a weaker story for Valak, and Valak's become such a big character in the Conjuring universe that um, I would have liked to have seen the first Valak movie to be, um, to be better. All right. That was nine, eight, seven. All right, number six is Annabelle Creation. Annabelle Creation was definitely a big step up from the first one. It told a, a much better story, um, had, a, had better scares in it. Um, it was also a little bit generic as well. It, so it, it's kind of a mid-tier Conjuring movie for me. Not bad, not great. All right. Number five is The Nun 2. The Nun 2 is the most recent Conjuring movie. Definitely a big step up from the first one. Uh, still kind of suffered from the fact that the best Valak story has already been told. And um, and yeah, it, 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 it was good for what it was, but it's still kind of a mid-tier Conjuring movie. All right, number four is The Conjuring 3, The Devil Made Me Do It. Um, I, I liked this one more than a lot of other people, I think. I really enjoyed this, how this one switched gears, kind of focused a lot on the courtroom drama side of it, um, the, the, the case of this person. Um, you know, I researched some of it and some of this stuff actually happened. And uh, that was pretty fascinating for me as a history, as a history buff. Number three is Annabelle Comes Home. This is easily the best of the Annabelle movies. This one was a lot of fun. Uh, definitely great to see the Warrens incorporated into the story more and um, having having the daughter play a much bigger role in this. I definitely enjoyed it. Annabelle Comes Home quite a bit. Number two is the first Conjuring movie. Um, the one that, that kind of set the stage for this universe. Um, scary, atmospheric, um, Tense. This one offered everything that you want to see in a haunted house movie. This one was a very good movie. But the best one, however, is still The Conjuring 2. The Conjuring 2 offers up so much. It's scary. It's well written. It's, uh, it's atmospheric. It's tense. It expands the universe of The Conjuring, but tells a very, um, a very direct and easy to follow story. The Conjuring 2 is one of my favorite haunted house slash ghost movies of all time and it's easily for me the best in this universe but that's just my take on it what do you think what's the best conjuring movie how would you rank them let me know in the comments below